going on YouTube, Geosno right here. So in today's video I'm going to show you how to install real themes, real custom icons on your home screen without web clips on iOS 15.0 up to iOS 16.1.2 on all devices including iPhone 14, iPhone 13, 12 and stuff like that. This video is brought to you by AnyUnlock, a software that allows you to unlock the screen passcode, bypass MDM and even remove SIM lock. Definitely check the program out in the link below. So I have published a full article on iDeviceCentral.com on how to do this, how to install the themes and stuff like that. That. This doesn't require a jailbreak at all, there are multiple themes available for you to install and the instructions are pretty simple, so let's get straight into it. To do this we're going to use Kawabanga, which yes it works fine now, so if you were not using Kawabanga because it was glitchy at the beginning or it was buggy for you, you should definitely retry it now because they fixed a lot of bugs and themes apply very well now. So you can get it over here on GitHub on the releases tab, sideloaded with either alt store or sideloadly or whatever, and then you will be able to have it on your device and as you can see currently I have a theme installed on my device and it looks rather nice. So it themes many of the icons including the files, health, uh, find my and apparently an update is upcoming which will fix two issues. It will add theming for the clock application which is definitely nice and it will also fix the icons that are blurry. Sometimes the YouTube icon is a little bit blurry or massively blurry sometimes and apparently this week there will be an update that fixes that so it will make Kawabanga even better. Remember Kawabanga doesn't require a jailbreak which which means that you can do all of these from inside this application without a jailbreak and it's not detectable by any jailbreak detection in app. So you can have themes installed, you can have Kawabanga and no application will ever complain. So to install themes after you get Kawabanga you just go here to explore tab and there will be all the themes available in here. And currently there are many of them, you can actually choose between multiple themes and as I said it's important to know these are not web clips, you are actually changing the icon of the apps and these are not shortcuts or web clips or whatever. Whatever. It's actual themes just like on a jailbreak. And these are a couple of themes that are currently available. There are also passcodes available, passcode faces available. You can see these basically replace your passcode screen with these over here instead of the numbers. And uh, there are multiple ones in here as well. You can customize those as well if you want to. And there are also locks available over here. So yeah, various icons for the lock and stuff like that. Troll faces, Apple event, whatever. But I'm gonna go with icons. And I'm gonna install another theme over here. Let me check out one that I like. Uh, let's go with this one, Felicity Pro over here. All of the themes in here are completely free, so that's actually great. You don't have to pay for Kaobanga, you don't have to pay for themes. So I'm gonna go over here, and as you can see, I have all of them installed over here. And Felicity Pro is this one over here. I'm gonna select it and then apply theme. And that's about it. It will apply it and respring. If you go ahead in here, you can see that now I have the icons from the Felicity Pro. And as you can see here on YouTube, that's the issue I was talking about with the icon being a bit blurry. That will be fixed in an upcoming update and the clock icon will also get themed in the upcoming update but as you can see over here the theme does apply and all the blurriness will be fixed in the next update and these are proper applications if you click on an application it will actually open the application it's not a web clip so that's how you do it that's how you install themes on iOS 16 that's how you install themes on iOS 15 it may not be perfect at the moment but it's a very good replacement and the next update will make it even better thank you for watching I am Geosnow peace out